What's up guys? I'm all foggy and shit, so we're gonna have to redo this intro again. No, I'm not. Yeah, there we are. <laughs> oh, fuck, I'm weird. Alright, I can't see shit. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sweating because I have the air condition off. You know what? Fuck that. If you guys get a little bit of air condition noise, I'm sorry. I gotta do what I gotta do. You are on the fastest route. I'm on the fastest route, apparently. So, uh, what's up? Today, this is kind of a weird sight. We're going to the track. Uh, normally, Cecil County, you know, love that place. One of my favorite tracks, if not my favorite track in the country. But today, we're trying out Del Mar. Uh, AKA Route 13 Dragway because of rain up in the Cecil County Rising Sun region. But yeah, so today we're actually getting the car out to run. It's been so long since I've been able to do this and a long time coming since I could get this thing back out on the track again. So I have a long timeline of events I'm about to throw at you guys of what exactly has happened just to kind of summarize these foggy ass glasses just to kind of summarize what's been going on if you don't want to hear that I'll put an annotation on screen right now or down in the description so you can skip straight to the racing if you want to hear the timeline that's cool too so I put it in here anyway so here's what happened basically I got a clutch put in the car um, from my buddy Josh over at Horsepower Addicts all this fancy shit you guys got over here Mm -mm -mm. Dude, somebody should invent, like, I should invent that. A dildo drone? Yeah. Oh, God. All kinds of stuff. We need, we need Nick here. We need Nick Hopkins here. For what? The dildo drone? <laughs> I screenshotted every picture of him in uh, Street Car Takeover. I saw him in the back screenshot. I was like, yo, I know, I know Nick Hopkins. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, so she's done. There she is. They hooked it up. Uh, did the new slave cylinder, uh, tech adjustable master. Clutch was feeling good. Uh, still had the stock wheels on the car. I put up the video where we went down to cruise weekend, picked up the welds. So we have 17s out back now. A little bit more sidewall. Should be able to hook better on the track. Uh, it's going to take a minute to get used to them. So no promises out of me today. But... Uh, we got those out back, 18 by fours up front, or four and a halfs or whatever. Uh, so we have the skinnies dropping weight and picking up traction. So uh, they looked good, they felt good. Did a you know a couple little test roonies. Uh, got one decent pull in on them, and literally on the second pull, the car broke the half shaft. Uh, like you saw in the previous videos. By the way, there's a, uh, a whole playlist full of videos that I'll also link down below and on the screen right now. Uh, if you want to see the whole progress of this car and keep up with what's going on if you're kind of in the dark right now. Uh, but anyway, yeah, it ended up being more than just a half shaft. Uh, the C-clip came off the axle, fell in the diff, or at least we thought it did. Uh, so I sent the car back to Horsepower Addicts to pull the diff apart uh, because, you know, I, I don't have the room or necessarily the skills to do that and I just didn't want to do it I didn't want the car to be down long so I sent it off to them they pulled apart and the, cl the clip wasn't in there so I don't know where it magically disappeared to but I guess that's kind of a mystery I'm trying to think what else oh yeah when I was doing pulls in the car there's another thing second gear it felt like the clutch was slipping originally uh, like when I would hit second it would hesitate for a second and then lock in uh, it felt like the clutch was slipping, but after all the new hydraulics and the new clutch, it was still doing it. So we did a tiny little tweak to the tune and it seems to be gone now. So between the new wheels and tires, the new clutch and that little tweak, I really think we should be able to bust into the tents. And if we don't, my parents live right by this track that I'm going to and they live literally maybe a hundred feet from a boat ramp. So we're gonna go see mom and dad and push this car in the fucking bay if it doesn't go tense today. I don't know if they do it. Oh. 
5714 miles per hour. second pass it went a 17660 which still isn't the greatest but it's a big improvement so it went 1090 at 131 Whoa, 1090 for the 17660 but there's no video hopefully someone in the stands got it I feel like you're Joey right now. He does shit like that too. <laughs> so we're gonna let it cool down. Uh, we're catching that sound <laughs> And uh we'll get it next time. I'll get it next time. Next time you're gonna do even better. Hope so. We will. So uh we're gonna go catch Sal's Viper and do another hit. Uh,